Imagine this, 8.2 billion people standing as close together as they can, clapping all at the exact same moment. Could this massive clap create a shockwave powerful enough to cause an earthquake or maybe even end human existence? Let's find out. Every person takes on average 0.2 square meters of space. Multiplied by 8.2 billion, the total area required is 1,640 square kilometers. Since Death Valley is about eight times larger, everyone would definitely fit there. So, let's teleport the entire Earth's population there. Here we are. The average clap produces a sound of around 100 decibels. Now, if every person clapped at once, the sound waves wouldn't just add up to form one massive sound wave. When they overlap, some waves would amplify each other like this, but others would cancel each other out. Also, the clap from the person in the last row wouldn't be heard all the way to the front row due to the dispersion of sound energy. Let's see how loud we can get. We'll measure the sound with a decibel meter. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Wow, that was loud. The sound wave produced reached an astonishing 140 decibels. That's as loud as a jet engine from close up and could rupture your eardrum after brief exposure. But that's not all. What if we clapped in a sequence so that the sound waves perfectly amplify each other? It would be very hard to time and environmental factors would have to be considered, but the sound wave would probably be much louder. Let's test it out. Three, two, one. Wow, that was way louder than before. 190 decibels. Because decibels are measured on a logarithmic scale, 190 decibels are actually about 100,000 times louder than 140 decibels. At this intensity, the shockwave would not only cause severe damage to human ears instantly, but can also lead to internal injuries or even death. The actual cause of death wouldn't come from the ear damage itself, but from the rupture of lung alveoli due to the immense pressure. The force could shatter glass, crack walls, and possibly even damage nearby structures, though luckily Death Valley doesn't have buildings, so that's one less concern. However, while it may not completely wipe out humanity, the sound probably wouldn't generate an earthquake either. Earthquakes arise from tectonic shifts deep below the surface, which sound waves alone aren't powerful enough to trigger. So we'd be safe from a massive geological disaster, just not from a deafening shockwave.